So when you first consider uh, cloud computing, what do you actually need to build a cloud? You first have to determine what kind of cloud do you really want? Do you want something that's like infrastructure as a service? Are you more interested in platform as a service? Do you want something that's going to be built on premise and you want your own private cloud? Do you want to really better utilize the public clouds? Or do you want something kind of in the middle where it's on premise, but you want to be able to burst out to the public cloud and truly have a hybrid cloud offering? So let's say, for example, you're a developer and you want to build out a new application in the cloud. You could come and use our platform as a service offering that's offered online and build your application out there, do your tests and development, even take it into production. But we know many of you, when you build your applications and actually run them into production, actually want to have them secured inside your data center behind your four walls. So we also offer cloud solutions that allow you to build out your own infrastructure as a service and then host those applications online and on-premise. So we give you the ability to move back and forth your applications between building them online, building them on-premise. It's all about choice. So when you take a look at all the things that you have to do to build a cloud, a lot of people in the market are really building silos out of their cloud. They're actually saying, if you want to take advantage of our cloud, you have to use what's specific in our offering. You have to use our operating system, our languages, our frameworks. And as long as you use those things, you can get the benefits of cloud, such as automation, elasticity, and self-service, but you have to stay within that silo. At Red Hat, we don't believe that you're going to use just one vendor's products. We believe that you're going to use multiple vendor's products, and you want to be able to move across those different silos. You want to choose your own platforms. You want to choose your virtualization providers, your public cloud providers, your frameworks, your languages. And you want to be able to go across those silos as well as up and down those stacks. And that's what Red Hat's all about. We're all about bringing you that type of choice to have a heterogeneous cloud.